After months and months of waiting and watching, Brandon Bruning returned to basketball and the game's biggest stage. The final seconds of Bishop Newman's quarterfinal win coming less than one year after temporary paralysis confined him to a wheelchair. It was definitely one of the main highlights in my journey and if anything it almost took me back to last year playing in the days and it was just a good memory. Nearly one month after helping the Cavaliers to the 2016 state championship, a one car crash would change Brandon Bruning's life forever. He would fracture a vertebrae in his lower back and need nearly 11 weeks to relearn how to walk. I was never told that I was never going to walk again, but if I would have been, I, I had it in my mindset that I, it wasn't going to be me in a wheelchair. Bruning missed out on his final year of high school football, but believed in a comeback on the basketball court. It came on senior night, with a pre-planned layup giving him his only points of the year. Bruning went on to play in all three games of this year's state tournament, capping his career with back-to-back -back state titles, celebrating the end of a run and the next step in his journey. I'm hoping in the next couple months my uh, cane goes away, and then I guess my next goal is to run, jump, have fun, and maybe even play in some Bishop Newman alumni tournaments. That return will be as a two-time champion on the court and an inspiration off it. In Lincoln, Matt Lothra, KETV Newswatch 7 Sports.